as levels of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere increase. This then increases the amount of carbon dioxide dissolved in ocean water. Much of this then can react with water molecules to form carbonic acid, which then increases the acidity of ocean water, decreasing its pH. This can affect marine life. Many uh, have specific pH tolerances, and it uh, affects those marine organisms which create calcium carbonate shells or casings around themselves because when there is a greater acidity, when there's more hydrogen ions, these hydrogen ions react with carbonate to form bicarbonate, and thus there is less carbonate um, available for these organisms to absorb from ocean water to create their, cell, uh, their shells. And uh, these organisms uh, which rely on calcium carbonate um, include corals, mollusks, uh, and a number of smaller organisms uh, which can be found in plankton and the basis of food chains, such as foraminiferans, uh, many algae, uh, crab larvae, and others. And decreased density of calcium carbonate has been observed in organisms as diverse as corals and crabs. And many coral reefs, such as uh, the Great Barrier Reef in South China, uh, sea uh, corals have been observed to be, uh, be becoming less dense. Because of concern over the effects of climate change, carbon dioxide is measured in both the atmosphere and seawater and the pH of ocean water has been measured and increases in the carbon dioxide levels of the atmosphere correlate with increases in carbon dioxide in seawater and a decrease in the pH of uh, ocean water. Obviously, the ocean can vary from one part of the world to, to another with currents and other aspects but rising carbon dioxide in ocean water have been consistently observed throughout the world, such as these examples here of Bermuda, Hawaii, and the Canary Islands. In the past 200 years, the oceans have absorbed more than 500 billion tons of carbon dioxide resulting from human activity, as humans have burned fossil fuels such as coal and petroleum and have cut down the forests which absorb carbon dioxide. Thus, the ocean's acidity has increased 30% as uh, this carbon dioxide became carbonic acid, causing the pH of the ocean to drop from 8.2 to 8.1. Now, that might not seem like a lot, but the pH scale is a logarithmic scale. By the year 2100, it is feared that the ocean's pH could decrease to 7.8 if humanity continues the emissions uh, at current levels, which would threaten a mass extinction of many marine organisms.